So day two of our Disney trip, we are at Epcot. Uh, I actually changed our ticket day. We were supposed to be at Magic Kingdom, but I really wanted to try the Guardians of the Galaxy ride. So <laughs> it's funny because this morning at 7 a.m., I mean, this morning, uh, Disney Genie was down, even though it's a virtual queue for Guardians. Um, it was down, um, but I still got the virtual queue. It said to be back at 11 for Guardians, but when we were getting breakfast at club level, it was like, your time is now. So now it's said to return by 9.40. Uh, so we'll see if they'll still honor it because it's like 10 o'clock because we had to wait like 20 minutes for the buses. And then we had issues with our tickets. That was pretty quick to resolve. Uh, so we'll see if they'll let us in. I mean, we'll see. Oh, you're not going to ride it? Oh, okay. Well, do you want to? Citizens of Epcot, does anyone know what they call themselves? What? I'm on? Someone needs to tell me what I'm on. Welcome, Epcot Terrence. I am Centurion Talmeric, and we're just about ready to teleport you up to the ship for the demonstration. Guardians of the Galaxy for the first time, and it was so fun. Uh, me and the lady were like singing the song. I forgot what song it's called. It's like one way or another. I forgot what that song's title is, but we were singing it together. It was quite fun. Um, really exciting. I liked it. Kind of want to do it again, but not today. I can't like. I have no idea what these are, but they're really cute. Little stuffed animals. Or, no, or lots of. It's Someone said they all kind of smell like lots of really good cookies. I think they're supposed to be one of those. Those are sweet treats, pink treats, frozen treats. Oh, they're scented plushes? Oh, that's That's a huge cookie jar. Sixty bucks. Yeah. So we stopped by Japan and got apple sake and also the Donbury. Oh, that's really good. That's super tasty. And then we got the Donbury salmon Donbury. The figment of imagination. Yeah, I know all about the senses. They're sight, sound, smell, touch, goochie goochie go, and taste. Taste like chicken. Can I go? Please, please, please. No, I don't want you out of my sight. Out of sight? Okay. Come on, everybody. Here we go. Here's a real open house. Come on in. Yeah. So 
Welcome to our living laboratory, where scientists from Epcot and the U.S. Department of Agriculture are exploring innovative ways to produce better organisms now and into the future. The tropics are home to the greatest. Hey, so we had fun at Epcot. Um, it's funny because, like, we did a few things that we haven't done in a while. Actually, I don't think me and my husband have ever been on the Figment ride. I don't really recall it. I think I like am familiar with the song just being a Disney nerd. But I mean, you don't remember the Figment ride ever? No, no. not really. I know the song. I've heard it, but I don't remember ever going on that ride. And then I we did that pavilion being originally the Honey I Shrunk the Kids uh, thing. Yeah. And then we did the land they call it again? I forgot. Living the land. Living the land. Um, I like it. Like, you get to see all the plants and fishies that they, you know, produce and eat. <laughs> and then we came back, we took a short nap and uh, got freshened up. It was so humid at Epcot. I mean, in Florida. It wasn't that hot. Like, I felt like the, hum the heat wasn't the bad thing. It was just the humidity. It was so sticky. And it's humid now, but I think because there's a nice breeze, it looks like we're going to get some weather um, tonight. Uh, but we are hitting up Hollywood Studios tonight. We have reservations at Hollywood and Vine. They're doing their special Halloween um, outfits, um, so I'm excited. I haven't done character di well, I haven't done character dining in a while, actually. April, we did character dining. But... Uh, so yeah, so but I haven't like seen Mickey at a character dining since I don't remember. I forgot what the last character dining with Mickey. Because uh, I think when I went to Chef Mickey's, it was like post COVID, like just as they opened, and I don't think the characters were there. So I don't recall the last time I've seen Mickey. But it was cool. Um, we'll get we'll get to see them. We also have. We came back because I also wanted to check out. This, today is like the only day that we'll actually get to see the um, cop, like I, I can't say hors d'oeuvres, the appetizers, like kind of like the evening um, meal per se. They don't really say meals, but uh, but they have like huge chunks of salmon. I was like, you can make this meal. Like like those chunks of salmon weren't messing around and uh, pasta and I can't the little Greek puff pastries. It starts with an S, I can't pronounce it. Um, and then we'll miss cocktail hour uh, because we have 9.35 reservations at uh, Oga's Cantina tonight. Uh, but we're gonna have fun, I'm excited. Uh, so yeah, so let's go to Hollywood Studios. So we finished up at Hollywood and Vine. The food was not that good, except for like a few dishes, like the salmon, the cocktail shrimp, but, and like the desserts were good. Otherwise, it wasn't that good. Um, the character interactions though were amazing. Uh, we had a lot of fun with the characters. They came around multiple times, which is nice, because sometimes some character dinings, they only come like once or twice. But they came multiple times. Um, so yeah, so would I ever go back again? Uh, maybe before a baby is like older, but I wouldn't go for the food. I feel like you get better food at like Artist Point and some other care. I mean, I mean, yeah, I can't, 
like blanking on other character dinings that we've done right now because my brain is so tired. But uh, yeah, ours point, same price point. I definitely go back there before I would go back to Hollywood and Vine. But we're gonna enjoy the night. It's a nice night and catch the fireworks at Hollywood Studios. So instead of watching the fireworks at Hollywood Studios, I decided to go to uh, Slinky Dog Dash, which was a lot of fun. I haven't ridden that in a while. Uh, we have 935 reservations at Oga's Cantina. Um, and just like a lot of people ask this question, they're like, oh, how do I have reservations after the park closes? Well, I guess they just do it. And so yeah, it's actually nice. It's, the, it's actually a nice way to see uh, Galaxy's Edge at night. It's beautiful at night. I don't know, I love it at night. Just a different atmosphere. Uh, so yeah, if you get a late night reservation, Definitely take it, it's awesome. got in we did Oga's it was so much fun I I always like Oga's um, I just like the the staff the cast members and the atmosphere it's just a lot of fun so if you like Star Wars I mean I don't even know if you I don't even think you need, really need to like Star Wars I think if you like if you like Trader Sam's I think you like Oga's because they just have a fun atmosphere the drinks are good um, we didn't order any snacks. There are, they have a few, like very few snacks. So, um, but yeah, we enjoyed. We started talking to the couple next to us. They were so sweet. Um, we chit chatted with them all night because we had such a late reservation. Um, uh, we pretty much closed the house out. Uh, they kicked us out. Um, but it was so nice to just walk through the parks with it being so empty. Um, I love that. Uh, so yeah, so um, it was a good night, and we came back, and um, one of the cast, like the bus cast members, my husband just went up to him. He's like, "What bus is this?" And he was like, "I'll take you wherever you want." And uh, so we, because that's like one of the hassles of, you know, getting, uh, you know, being so late is sometimes the buses aren't, you know, as frequent. But he he took us there, so took us back, so. Uh, we crashed and burned. I mean, I was, as soon as I did my thing, got ready, I was out. Um, so yeah, so, as you can tell, I'm looking a little tired. I, I think I need to drink a little bit more water, probably to get a Gatorade. Um, so they just don't drink enough water in the theme parks, which is bad. So, drink water. But, anyways, I will close this out. Hope you like and subscribe. I hope you enjoyed 
day two of adventures. I need to shoot my outro for day one, but I'm so tired. I don't remember what happened on day one. I'm getting bad at the outros, but anyways, I'll see you later.